Mr. Speaker, and I thank the gentle lady from New York. Mr. Speaker, I reintroduce H.R. 449 to enhance counterterrorism preparedness at the local level. In recent years, we've seen acts of terrorism, especially in planning and execution, take place in cities throughout our nation. Whether it's occurred in a church in Charleston, a synagogue in Pittsburgh, or a nightclub in Orlando, local law enforcement is the front line of defense in protecting our communities from acts of violence. It is therefore necessary to equip our first responders with the tools to allow them to quickly adapt to the evolving terrorist threat landscape. This bill, H.R. 449, does just that. Today, the Department of Homeland Security's training catalog is a primary resource for state and local jurisdictions to find opportunities to enhance their counterterrorism and preparedness capability. Specifically, H.R. 449 directs DHS Office of State and Local Law Enforcement to produce, as you heard, and distribute an annual catalog of training programs and services to state, local, and tribal law enforcement communities to ensure that this information is shared throughout the law enforcement community to agencies large and small. H.R. 449 requires this comprehensive catalog be posted on the DHS website as well as on the Homeland Security Information Network. Enactment of this bill will further strengthen the department's partnership with state and local law enforcement to help better protect the homeland. With that, I urge my colleagues to support this legislation and I yield back the balance of my time. Lady from New York, do you reserve? 